Hello, my wonderful students. Today, we're going to start with a new topic, talking about graphs. We are going to specify the graph that we are going to be talking about. We will be talking about a bar graph, how we make a bar graph, how we read a bar graph, and a bar graph itself, how do we represent a bar graph itself. Let's get started with making. Now, bar graphs, as you can see, you can represent a bar graph by using tally, tally marks. For example, if I want to choose a favorite food that my whole class likes, you are going to put the, the topics in a tally mark and count the amount. Then using a bar graph, you are going to represent the amount of people that liked that specific favorite food. As you can see over here, they showed you about their favorite dinosaur. Looking at this bar graph, what do you think is the favorite dinosaur around all of them? Let's see how we can read. We have over here favorite student, a favorite color of students. As you can see, we have the number of students, 0, 5, 10, 15, 20, 25 students. We have the favorite color, which is red, yellow, blue, and green. One unit, we always have a scale. One unit equals five students. So we have over here the red, we have 10 students. We have yellow, we have five students. And we have blue over here, 20 students. And over here we have green, which is 15 students. So as you can see over here, we have a different type of bar graph that talks about the school supplies students use. The types of school supplies, as you can see, pencils, scale, pen, sharpener, eraser, and the scale shows the number to show how many, and the label talks about the categories to tell what each bar stands for and the type of school, uh, type of school supplies that we are talking about. Okay, looking at this bar graph, let me zoom it in a little bit. Looking at this bar graph, what do you think is how, ma how, many, uh, how many students showed, uh, showed blue? So let us look at the favorite color of the student. So how many students showed blue, which is 20 students, 20 students in this uh, bar graph? Let us go to the next one. We have over here how many over here what is the least color of the number of students that they liked so for example the following is yellow how many students chose red as you can all see it shows red that is 10. okay i hope that you enjoyed my lesson and i will see you in our next lesson